YouTube, today I'm gonna open up the Remington Auto Reset Air Gun Target. Here's the front of the box. And here's the back of the box. It looks like some kind of bird, but I'm pretty sure it's a crow. And then you stick it in the ground, like in the dirt or the grass, and you shoot it and it automatically resets. So you can just shoot it as much as you want and it, you know, you'll never have to go walk up and put it back up. So now I'm gonna open it. This is how this works. First, you just shoot the target, which is right here. Pow. Then, oh no, how do I get it back up? Well, obviously this is an auto reset target, so that doesn't mean they're gonna make you come back up, set it back up. So once I've shot it, how do I get it back up? Well, there's gonna be this yellow circle down here and I'm gonna shoot it and that automatically resets it. So I can shoot here, shoot here, and keep having nonstop fun without having to go back and put this up. So you can have one long nonstop training session. If you're a sharpshooter or you keep hitting it and it's getting a little bit easy, cause this hole's kind of big, then you can take this right here and put it like this and it makes the hole a little bit smaller in case you wanted it to be harder. So now it's like this. And if you want it even harder, you can take this one, which is this tiny piece. Put it here like this, then close it. And now it's an even smaller hole if you want to do it extreme. And this is, by the way, meant to be used with lead pellets. So to make sure you're using this right, first of all, if you're using 177 caliber pellets like I am, then make sure you're, the gun you're using with these pellets has at least 1,000 FPS. And the minimum distance you should be at, if you're using that, should be about 25 yards. Next, this is if you're using 22 caliber pellets. If you're using 22 caliber, I would recommend you to be at least 800 FPS, and I would recommend you to be about 35 yards away. I'm using 177 caliber, not 22 caliber. This is very portable. It comes with all these little pieces that you can attach onto here for when you're storing. These pieces are just rubber pieces you can put on for protection, or whenever you're not using it. Wow! Whenever you're actually using this, you're gonna take it off and you'd use this, stick it in the ground really far, like I'd say up to here. Okay, next is the 12 inch heavy spike. Now that's basically just this. And what this is, is whenever you stick it in the ground, like from with this part, it's meant to let it bounce. Cause if it just sticks in the ground, it's gonna fall over. With hard ground, obviously it's not gonna fall over, but this is basically just meant for soft ground in case you have to put it there. So what's good about this is it's long lasting, heavy duty steel construction. So this thing can take a lot of damage and it will not break easily. Okay, now let's go shoot it. I think that's good. I'm gonna go get a gun. Oh no! Oops! Okay, so I got my pellet gun loaded. Now I'm ready to shoot. This is really accurate. I hit it! Finally, I hit it. Yeah. Huh? Yeah, I hit it. Yeah. Yay, I hit it. I hit it, but it didn't flip up. See, this is where I hit. I hit here, it flipped up a little bit and just flipped back down. Oh, no! I hit here and then hit it, but it's supposed to flip back up. Okay, so what happened is first it was like this. The first time I hit here, then to flip this back up, I had to hit down here. And I hit here, 
And this went up a little bit. I don't know if you saw or not, but this part went up a little bit and it just went back down. So it should have came up like this. I just guessed that shot wasn't powerful enough, but you can see how it looks like once you hit it, like the paint chipped off. <gasps> so this is the most powerful gun I have right now because it's 1000 FPS. Even though it said any gun 1000 FPS or over, and this one's 1000 FPS, I guess it just wasn't powerful enough. No. So once I get a gun more powerful, I'll use it. Yeah. Okay, so that's the end of the video. <laughs> and if you want to see more fun videos, then don't forget to subscribe. Peace out.